I, 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 this is a really inappropriate place to do that. Can you stand inside the camera so they can see your face? International lover and... And here we go. And cue action. Stola, Stola. Name, please. I'm Victoria Maneska. Anastasia Kiku. Chris George. Mike Short. Mike Sutton. I'm Bart Knack. Hype Scott. Daniel Maslin. My name is James Lindsay. Eddie Brown. Fanny Pietak. Selena Gillespie. Juana Junko. Uh, so my name is Rob Lambert. Berglind Bergstotter. Ash Coleman. My name is Alex Schwartz. I'm Alex Schladerbeck. Lisa Crispin. Son Vazal. What country are you from? I'm from Macedonia. Spain. I'm from New Zealand these days. I'm from the Netherlands. I'm from Britain. Uh, in or out of Europe, depending on when you're watching this. I'm from Canada. Well, I'm from Australia, but I live in Britain now. I'm from Sweden. I'm from Iceland. The United States. France. Job title, please. Oh, job title. Oh, that's a tough one. Well, that's very funny you mentioned that. I'll have to look at my business card. That's complicated. Hmm, leadership coach? That's the easiest thing to say. Um, I'm a trainer. Um, QA engineer. Entrepreneur. Ooh, my job title is Head of Software Quality and Test Consulting. Um, agile coach, test mentor. Uh, let's say consultant coach. Tester, maybe, also. Agile business DJ. <laughs> um, I, my job title officially is something like coach. Mostly test strategies, sometimes toy maker. I give a job title to myself, and my current job title is um, science evangelist. How many Agile Testing Day conferences have you attended? Oh my god, I was expecting that question and I can't answer it. I think it's about six, it might be seven. This is my first one. I think five. This is my eighth. Four. I've been six times. This is, this, I guess it's the seventh. I sort of lost count, but I figure about seven. All of them, which is nine at the moment. I intended actually all of them. Nine. What's been your favorite moment from all the times you've come to the conference? Out of all of them? There's so many, I can't tell you one. That's a hard question. Yeah. There's been too many. It's very hard to pick one single favorite moment. I would say it's the atmosphere. I came with my son the first time I came, and he was nine at the time. And we, together, were so warmly welcomed. The networking? I will go with Link Coffee. Speaker dinners. I had the chance to attend the speaker's dinner without actually being a speaker. Oh my god. Um, well, that, that, I really always like the, the, the parties. Uh, the, the Rube Goldberg machine. It was pointless and it took two and a half days worth of people really building really hard and it was hilarious and I loved it. The table two moment. The talks are great, the lineup is amazing. It was probably seeing Lisa Crispin come out on a live horse. Quite a few years back was when uh, Lisa Crispin won the award for the most influential Agile tester and she entered onto the stage on a horse. Getting to ride a horse into the conference dinner uh, dressed as a knight. It was very good, very funny, and, and exactly in keeping with the spirit of this conference. How many beers did you have last night? Oh, too many. <laughs> too many. That's a very personal question. <laughs> what? A, is this an alcoholic question? Did, did Uber write that one? Two very good red wines. Nine. Oh, heavens. Uh, <laughs> a, a, a couple. <laughs> I didn't count because it, yes. <laughs> Far too many for a man of my age and maturity. <laughs> I don't know, 10 maybe? <laughs> half, half, half. It, my, they just keep refilling my glass. <laughs> I actually know because I kept score and I didn't want to go crazy. Um, I probably had about four beers last night. Uh, maybe five. <laughs> So it was four and a wine. Oh, doesn't sound like I did hope. Only one, actually. I had three glasses of wine, but I only had one beer. So no, not that much, actually. One, and it was non-alcoholic because I was sat next to a guy who was drinking non-alcoholic beer and I didn't realize. I just said, yeah, I'll have what he's having. How would you describe adult testing days in one word? 
Fantastic. 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 But maybe a different word. Fun-tastic. Fun. 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 Amazing. Genuine. Awesome. 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 And unicorn. Unicorn. Community. Work family. I know it's two, but still. Family. Community. Actually, can I change the last answer? Family. Uh, are you going to be back for the 10th anniversary next year? Oh, definitely. Absolutely, I hope so. Yeah. Yeah. If, yes. Absolutely, absolutely, absolutely. If I'm invited, no, I, I guess I'll be back. <laughs> oh, yes, yes. Even if they don't invite me as a speaker, I'll be here next year. It's like a drug, you know? Once you come here, first time when you come here, you want to come next, next time again and again. Hell yeah. Of course. <laughs> yes. Absolutely. 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 It's already in my calendar. I really hope so. Try and stop me. Absolutely.